Okay. Um, <coughs> communications. Our first communication is from a Bright Krinsky. Uh, he was unable to attend our presentation this evening, and I wanted to indicate his support for the Wheelock Park concept plan. And we will fi file this, we will accept this as informational. And another communication. Uh, Georgia Tasoulis is uh, resigning from the Library Board of Trustees. And I would recognize Councilor Greenwald for a motion. Thank you, Your Honor. I would move to accept the resignation with appreciation for the years of service. <coughs> Second. Okay. It's been moved and seconded. Is there any further discussion? Seeing none, are you ready for a vote? All those in favor? Opposed? It's unanimous. And the further communication. Communication from, from Councillor Clark on the special mission rescue vehicle. Okay, this communication, uh, the issue relating to the, uh, to the vehicle, to the uh, rescue vehicle, commonly known as the Bearcat, has been considered twice by the City Council. It's also been considered twice by the committee, by the uh, Finance Committee. We've had uh, a public forum, public hearing before the City Council relating to this matter. And at this point, uh, we don't have any new information, so I'm going to file this. Your Honor, I respectfully challenge the Chair. Okay. Uh, there, I believe there's a process for that. It requires uh, a second. Uh, City Attorney. It requires a second, Your Honor. Second. Okay, it's been moved and seconded. Now the debate is between you and the member who's right. challenging the Chair, Your Honor. All right. The... Uh, as I as I understand it, under under the under the rules, the uh, you're you're allowed to speak, and I'm allowed to speak, and and uh, then we will vote. Yes. And it requires a two-thirds vote of the council. If, so Your Honor, if I may. Yes. Uh, keeping in mind that the debate between you and the councilor is on the decision of the chair, and not necessarily the underlying merits yes. of the request. That's correct. And any discussion of the underlying merits of any discussion about the bear cat would be irrelevant. That this is only a discussion about about uh, challenging the ruling of the chair. Okay. Thank you, Your Honor. I would uh, um, I would say that there is new information, um, and that uh, Keen used to be. Uh, known for things like uh, uh, protecting the environment and uh, and innovative uh, urban planning i mean urban planning and, and things like that now uh we've become a national joke uh, i believe it's time to reconsider um with with other information that we do we've gathered through the finance committee as far as the use of the vehicle um i believe there's there's a lot of other inform you know, a lot of new information so i would challenge that there is no new information to discuss the uh, the chair the chair has decided to uh, file this as informational because we have had uh, extensive debate on the floor of the city council reg regarding this. Uh, the city council, in fact, voted twice to accept the uh, accept the uh, grant. Uh, once in 2010 and again in 2011, the uh, vehicle was actually delivered to us in 2012. In addition, we get uh, semi-annual reports from the uh, uh, police department relating to the use of the vehicle, uh, and there is certainly opportunity if if there is anyone that wishes to to debate the the use of that vehicle uh, to do that when the reports are received. So at this point. Uh, Regardless of, of what some national news satire program may wish may wish to say out of context about the uh, Bearcat, uh, you know there is there is no factual information that I'm aware of that has come forward. So the ruling stands, and I guess we're subject to a vote. Yes, uh, it requires a two. -thirds it, would, vote. it would be a roll call vote and require a two thirds vote. <coughs> Okay, just to be clear, a vote, an I vote would uh, uphold your ruling? Uh, a, 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 no, a, yeah, an, an, I vote. I, an, I, an I vote would, would uphold your, your challenge of, of my decision, and a no vote would be to sustain the uh, position of the chair. Okay. Ready. Councilor Roberts? No. Councilor Clark? Yes. Councilor Duffy? No. Councilor Redfern? No. 
Councilor Jacobs? No. Councilor Manwaring? No. Councilor O'Connor? No. Councilor Filio? No. Councilor Haig? Yes. Councilor Powers? No. Councilor Chadbourne? Yes. Councilor Meter? No. Councilor Jones? No. Councilor Richards? No. Councilor Greenwald? No. At least it wasn't 14 to 1. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, we've all been victims of 14 to 1 votes, too. <laughs> okay.